Hey folks, Homer Abara here at the Behemoth booth. Uh, you know, good friend of the GameSpot.com uh, fanfare. I'm with, uh, sorry, Aaron Young Johan. Uh, yes. <laughs> How you doing, man? Good. It's great. We're having a great show. Awesome. And you are the lead level designer, right? I am. All right. And we're showing. You guys are showing off Battle Block Theater in these cool, like, arcade cases. What's up with those? In house. Uh, yeah, we're showing off all new levels on all of our machines. Uh, all kinds of new gameplay since last year. We were talking about how we we're going to have hundreds of levels, and now we do. So there's all kinds of awesome new stuff to see if you come on by. Right. Uh, yeah, so it's our next game after Castle Crashers, and uh, we're really excited to be showing it off. So f for folks who don't know, give us a little rundown on uh, Battle Block Theater, what, what the gameplay is about and all that. So if you're familiar with uh, the Behemoth games, somehow Battle Block Theater is our craziest game yet. It's actually even more insane than Castle Crashers. So you're playing as prisoners that have been captured by cats and forced to do stage plays for their amusement. <laughs> so it's sort of a uh, platformer puzzle brawl kind of game. Uh, you're helping out your buddy or you're fighting your buddy. It's kind of like when you're fighting over the princess in Castle Crashers, yeah. but you're actually able to do that all the time. And we totally support you knocking your buddy into buzz saws or you know, occasionally helping each other. But it's all about just having a good time and uh, getting through the game and uh, tackling the challenges together no matter who you are and who you're playing with. So, oh, so you, you mentioned hundreds of levels. Hundreds. Hundreds and hundreds and hundreds. Actually, besides the uh, story mode we're showing off, there's also team versus team, all kinds of different modes. Uh, there's actually hundreds of different prisoners that you get to unlock, all kinds of different weapons and tools that you get to use to either fight or help you platform, uh, platform through the levels. So there's just a huge amount of content. Uh, it's the biggest game we've ever made, and we're just really excited about it, hoping to get out as soon as possible. From a, from a level de design perspective, did you find it challenging to like have that variation that everybody is looking for? It's interesting because it, it can be really tricky. Uh, platformer games can be really punishing, and so can puzzle, gamers, uh, puzzle games, right? Uh, you know, it's, it's great because there's so much variety in the different blocks and how they work together that it gives me a lot of room to get really mischievous. And, uh, you know, sometimes that catapult might throw you uh, to where you want to go, but sometimes I might put some spikes over there. And, you know, it's, uh, it's great because the death mechanic, every time you get killed, you just pop in next to your buddy, and we just want you to have fun and keep messing around with each other and keep getting through the game. Uh, but at the same time, it gives me the leeway to just have a good time messing with people and you know you, you can discover things the hard way without getting too frustrated hopefully so it looks like these folks there's there's, there's a couple different landscapes we got going on up here it looks like there's kind of like this snow theme here and some fire over there what what, what kind of a uh, what kind of themes do you have in each level well if you're familiar with you know Dan Paladin's our artist as he was for Castle Crashers and he just constantly coming up with crazy creations and just out of control you know awesome cartoon creatures running around so there's all kinds of you know new and weird stuff to see as you get through the game these guys over here are actually doing the, the with the timer are actually doing our finale so they normally you get as much time as you want but these guys are going through a you know battle royale style you know death defying barbed wire strewn flame shooting you know run to the finish while the cats are, are you know shouting and cheering for them so oh, they're, they're running out of time though <laughs> It looks like there's like a teleporting uh, block there, right? Yeah, all kinds of things. Teleporters, buzz saws, missile shooting robots. There's a giant raccoon antelope crossbreed that chases you down and eats you. Uh, I really I don't want to spoil too much, but there's there's crazy stuff around every corner. It's very cool. Cool. So uh, are you guys putting the finishing touches on it now? Or? We are, actually. Yeah, we're talking to Microsoft, and so we can't set a release date quite yet, but it is coming along. We're getting to be about that point where we were uh, development-wise of Castle Crashers three years in. Uh, but yeah, it, it's coming along really well. Can we say calendar year 2012 officially? No? Uh, we want to make sure we've, we've talked to my staff and we got all that squared away. We don't want to disappoint anybody. All but right, coming soon is what we're hoping. So. Coming soon, you'll be able to play Battle, Battle Block Theater. Aaron, thanks so much for, for having us. This booth rocks. Look at this. Look at that. Look at all the skateboards. Yeah, we got to, you know, got to bring the arcade back. Uh, yeah. Got all our machines. Got Castle Crashes here if you want to play it the way it, Maybe it should have been played on the on the double wide arcade cabinet. Um, yeah, lots of stuff. We got our little mini capsule nights. Uh, we're showing off our, uh, you know, we got our Necromancer figure, which oh, we're yeah. kickstarting right now. Nice. Uh, you know, all kinds of cool new stuff to see. Yep. Cool. Aaron, thanks again. Appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of your show. Castle Crash or uh, the Behemoth booth. Come check it out. What number is this? What what booth number is this? Do we know? Forty two nineteen. Come to the come play some Battle Block Theater. All right, more from uh, the show floor when we continue.